No, I really am happy to be here, but I want you all to know, you know, this is about you. It's about you. You're the consultant. It's your business. We are a team. Some of you already know how lucky you are to have this lady at the helm and this lady at the helm of this team because they're going to make sure you get all the tools you need and you get all your questions answered. And um, I am here, and no apologies for my speaking ability. I am simply going to answer your questions, so that's why I'm here. And to begin with, before we get started, um, in the interest of time, when you have questions, jot them down on your piece of paper. You know, if you don't get to ask them today, we can certainly address them by email or some other way um, in the next few days. So um, I am just getting started as a coach for coaches. And so um, I'm going to be um, showing you the file system as if you're a brand new coach. And some of you are not. But it never helps. It never hurts to go back and you know, look at, look at what, um, what does work. And that's what Renee said. So the filing system is what we're going to work with. Um, you've already acquired your client, and you've already placed your order, and um, now you're looking at trying to make that first call after they get their food. So um, one of the things I want to show you before you start working with the file system is, you know, Renee said, just tell them what you do. I said, okay, that's fine. I'm a little nervous, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> So I send them that and I send them any other little point I want them to remember 
And then I go ahead and I attach preparation tips, which you can find in your back office. And I also attach the stovetop, stovetop cooking tips. Because, like Renee said, the first meal they usually want to fix is the oatmeal. <laughs> Let's all remember how to tell them how to prepare the oatmeal first time up, okay? It's their first meal, and they're going to tell you, hey, the oatmeal, unless they cook it right. So look at the preparation tips and um, educate yourself as well if you don't already know. Okay, so then we come to the filing system. At this point, it's the day that you need to call them, their first day. And I know you guys have all this, so let me just hold it up. Um, I get these through um, John's toolbox, and the information is to reorder is right on the inside of the um, filing system. Does everybody have these? Does every does not everybody use them? Raise your hand if you have a filing system. Okay, okay. This is what I use. You know, I started doing this back in late August, September, and before I made my first call. <laughs> I didn't know what I was doing, and I picked up the first folder, and it tells you A, B, C, D. This is what you talk about on the first call. How easy is that? You know, it's kind of like, you know, how to start your business for dummies. Only um, the geniuses and the ones at the helm of this company prepared these for us, and it's too easy. It's really too easy. So get your file system, and again, write that question down, because you want to know where to get it from. Um, www.johnstoolbox.com. They provide a lot of tools for us, and this is just one of them. Okay, so the file system is divided. I'm just going to talk about the first three files um, because, again, I'm gearing this toward new health coaches. The next three files are down the line, you'll use them too. But the first three files, when you call them the first day, this is it. It tells you everything to talk about on the front. It's the do's and don'ts, again, and they need to know them again. You need to confirm they read their quick start guide. It's right there for you to remember to tell them. Um, um, you're going to tell them what the schedule is going to be in terms of when you're going to be contacting them. You're going to be contacting them for the first three or four days because those are the crucial days. They may not be feeling so well, and they're going to need a little education, a little motivation. So that's what you're going to be doing. Let them know you'll contact them. And some people are going to say, you know what, that's not good for me. You know, I work hard all day, and then I come home. Okay, I'll be in, in touch by email or you touch base with me once a day. Debbie Postel has another system that works well, and maybe if there's um, time at the end, you'll help us understand how you get your people to contact you. But first three days, and then you'll be letting them know after that you're going to be start, starting to feel great, and then I'll be in touch, you know, once a week for the first month. And then eventually, and you can choose to tell them or not, eventually you're going to hand those reins back to them. They're going to be contacting you. They're going to know you there. They're going to know by that time that you're willing to help in any way you can. And they'll be in touch with you by phone and email too over time. So this is just to get started. Um, you're going to educate them on the fat burning state. Let them know first three days. If they're a little difficult, don't worry. By the third or fourth day, you'll be feeling energetic. You won't be hungry between meals. And you'll know you're doing everything right because that's how you'll feel. And I can't wait to hear you say that, right? Um, and then the support calls are here. Um, that's another email down the road. They're in the back of the quick start guide, the nurse's support call, the doctor's support call, and the maintenance call. They're in the back of the quick start guide, but it doesn't hurt to send out an extra email down the line. Two, three weeks maybe. You know, they have questions, and these are ways to help educate them about the program they're on, but also about the opportunity 